Hi everybody, welcome back to Time Predicts White Magic Spells and let's see what are the messages for you, what all I can tell you. Um, let's see the words they want to say or whatever they want to express, their feelings, anything that I can pick up. There's a soul agreement between you two. I saw the number 4, 4 is a number of strength, stability, foundations, two pillars standing in a relationship, being there for each other. So if you feel that you know the person for long and uh, you are connected, you know, when uh, you think you connected from the past life, I definitely want to say a yes because you started with a soul agreement. And look at this at the end of the deck. I've got two decks, I think, mixed here. And uh, the beauty of it is there was a soul agreement card just right here. And yeah, it was somewhere here. Yeah, here it is. And I just saw it back to back. So two soul agreements, two soul who are, uh, souls who are connected with each other, either from the past life or, you know, there, there is this connection and you connect with each other telepathically and this is so beautiful. Need courage to talk to you. So maybe the person you are with needs courage to talk to you. They want to come forward. They want to make a conversation. They want to make probably small talk. It could be a new person. It could be a new person in office, family, or in the friend circle who wants to talk to you but needs a little bit courage and encouragement <laughs> to talk to you. Maybe they're a little scared. Maybe they're a little shy. But somebody you've met recently, okay. I get there could be a five number, which is Mayborn or... Uh, uh, birth date could be five you could be a five number but they definitely want the they definitely want a courage to talk to you if you fought then they want a car they uh, are mustering up the strength or they're you know they're needing all the courage gathering all the courage to talk to you they're scared that if you if they talk to you you might shut them out okay taking it slow so somebody's taking it slow to respond remember this is a general reading and you'll have different messages for everybody so taking it slow it's actually maybe they need a courage to talk uh, maybe i'm also getting a new relationship where you don't know what to say and a little bit hesitant okay not saying things that are there in your heart so somebody's taking it slow in the relationship doesn't mean that they're not interested in you but uh, slow in coming towards you could be another message that i get okay so don't worry they will come towards you guys just a matter of time yeah why because fear of rejection somebody is worried that you will reject them you will not uh, you know talk uh, to them and that's why they need courage to talk to you because there is somewhere in their heart that seed that's been planted in their mind that you know uh, maybe you don't like them or you be, they've been giving you hints but you do not respond you're not picking up energies from somebody who really wants to be with you so open up and see who in your friend circle or in office or somebody wants to talk to you okay they're showing interest i pushed you away as i was scared somebody was scared they pushed you away maybe that time wasn't right and uh, because of the soul agreement they cannot disconnect with you totally because you've got two soul agreements but you know if the time wasn't right they are waiting for the right time to come back this is what you felt abandoned uh, the card is here you felt abandoned and uh, when they pushed you away i mean the other scenario that i get is you were going around was going well but somebody something happened and you know um, you were pushed away by them is it because of the family or time money some kind of thing that happened okay love your smile and eyes so that's what they love about you maybe you're going to get a compliment but love your smile and eyes spread guides please give me more messages let me shuffle like this because i've got two decks together here things will get better so that's a good sign a positive sign and good things will come your way i think it's a matter of time today also time is coming you know an hourglass was coming to my mind when i was speaking to you the sand falling choose now so maybe that's an ultimatum you <laughs> were thinking or your head and heart are saying choose now choose now it's a time maybe you're thinking which one is right for me because you've got friends and maybe you're getting confused with a choice I will take care of you so there is a promise coming of taking care of you and they are there to take care of you okay there's definitely a soul agreement between you guys some connection that you feel from the past and uh, the moment you met them it was like uh, so comfortable with each other and you felt like oh i've known them for so many years i have been through hell so the person who is uh, with you is saying they've been through hell. You could be twin flames or they could have had a bad past. And uh, maybe that's why they are taking it slow. And maybe that's why they pushed it away. They could not understand their feelings that time. So, and you've got a 444 at the counter. You've got an earth sign. You could be dealing with an earth sign, okay? I'm getting the word sand, sands of time. Busy right now. So that's how you they responded every time. Or maybe that's what they said and you did not 
understand you know are they interested not interested they're giving hints and they pull back what is really you know all of this thing that's happening you've got happiness i don't know but i got a name or a place or something that ends with a double s maybe that's your name like a jess or something res i mean i don't know but yeah this is the real thing so because it's a soul agreement it's a real thing i think uh, it takes time sometimes to be together in soul agreements twin flames or anything you know it takes time things will get better twice so definitely double confirmation you got from the universe that okay these two cards did turn in my hand and i have to say that you've got happiness again and look at this you've got bad timing something at that time wasn't right it was bad timing maybe that's why it's all about time and time right time needs to come in when right time comes everything falls in place don't go big message for you they don't want you to go things will get better and you know what the card is here i'll just pick it up and show you the deck that i wanted to use late but here it is have faith in me so things will get better and they wanting to the best thing is they want to work on it you know it's not that they've completely abandoned or at that time they would have in, uh, abandoned universe supports our love so that's a beautiful message listen to your heart they're probably saying listen to your heart maybe you just like choose now mind mind you just you know using your mind right now intellect and wondering what to choose but they're like definitely putting up their case and they're like you know choose me or choose now and uh, listen to your heart and i have to pick this up you understand me so well yeah definitely don't mess it please you know when i was saying jess and rest and i wanted to say the word mess and i was like oh god it's messy should i say it or not so don't mess it up please so they are saying when i come back when things get better maybe time wasn't right and uh, when time is right and you've got a soul agreement they will come back see options they're scared that you have options memories of course there's a soul agreement also feel memories from the past life in the sense you know you feel that instant connection and that bond and you're like oh we we know each other somehow ego for some of you ego might come into play so just be very careful okay love your smile and eyes i think we already got that so twice and divine timing i think that's the most important card and uh, i feel for you okay so they have feelings for you and like i said empathy telepathic destiny and they're saying i was wrong so many cards sleepless nights where should i stop one more sleepless nights something is troubling them or you i feel your pain and i think that's the most important because when they abandoned you you thought do they even know what they've done so for some of you it's yeah they were all over the place okay new lover for some of you and you've got focus focus on the things that you want things will be right let's see right away any cards i can tell you yeah there was some of a, some kind of a fight i think every everybody everything got entangled and with this five of uh, ones you know what i get one thing after the other time became a problem money became a problem job became a problem one after the other the timing wasn't right but now when they come back they're going to be on top of things they know what they want they're very focused and they're going to deal with you with a lot of clarity in the sense they will come with a lot lot of clarity with you you've got ones after ones you've got so much fire energy in these cards looking ahead looking into the future and you've got the sun card you've got a beautiful new beginning new things happening and you've got a new lover also so maybe it's a new uh, you know you've got options maybe for some of you this was the reading that you've got options new lover a beautiful beginning new things happening for some of you you'll uh, um, get into a new partnership uh, because this is creation or you might announce that you are pregnant so that's another thing that i get but beautiful card guys okay so take care that was my reading and enjoy your day bye guys